Hey everybody, it's Ben here and I wanted to show you a little setup I got. I'm doing some bench testing of this electric motor. This is a Mott Energy uh, ME1206. It's sort of an odd one. Uh, you won't find it on their website. Um, a friend of mine got a batch of these because they were kind of like a custom short run. And so he loaned me this motor, which is a brushless DC. And to go with it, a pretty cool motor controller. This is a Robotech RGBL1860. And so we've got our three phase cables going to the motor, other end going to the controller, and then there's some sensor wires here. That's for sine, cosine. And right now I've got my laptop, my Mac laptop, running Windows and connected by USB to the motor controller. And what's really cool is in here, you can configure this thing pretty much any way you want. Uh, for example, just for the throttle, it takes all sorts of different types of throttles, uh, including remote control or just running it right from the computer. All sorts of very, very cool things like that. Um, so for example, I could set it to run and use the slider here. And just with my mouse, I can uh, activate the motor, including uh, going to reverse, no problem. Uh, but another thing I thought, hey, for a throttle, I had one of these little um, hobby joysticks around. These are pretty popular for like an input for an Arduino. So I got the three wires coming off here, uh, five volts ground and signal. And over in here, you need a special connector to go into that, but I, I figured just kind of some little prototyping pins pushed right in. So it's just like working with an Arduino to connect a throttle, and I've got this set up so that this will also spin the motor. And uh, the other kind of a cool thing is um, there's command priority is one of these features. So right now priority one is the USB from the computer. Priority two is analog. So it's always gonna run from the computer first. Um, secondly, it'll go from the analog. So if we just put it in one of the screens that doesn't control from the computer, then I can just use my thumb And we're spinning the motor, and what's neat here too is this is spring-loaded back to center position. So this is great for like a momentary on, and springing back to center. Or reverse, spring back to center. Pretty slick. And another neat thing is I've got full control over the acceleration. Uh, ramp up, ramp down speeds on this. Um, and then another cool thing is control over for example, uh, maximum RPM. So I could set this to, for example, if I wanted to convert a tractor, have it run at 1800 RPM, I could simply put that in here as our maximum RPM and save that and we'd be good to go. So anyways, just bench testing this stuff, but these uh, Robotech controllers, pretty cool and brushless DC motors, neat, 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 neat stuff.